Baraku, Baraku, the Baraku, Baraku, the 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 Nobody is perfect. This nation isn't perfect. Africa isn't perfect. Africa This is why God sends prophets. To bring people back to God. Do we need the prophets? Do we need to hear the word? The answer is yes. The more prophets that are sent to Ethiopia, the more Ethiopia is blessed. Ethiopia is blessed because it's the land where God sends prophets. God sends messengers and he sent them to Israel. But you know what Israel did to the prophets? In the words of God, it says Israel killed the prophets. Have you ever read the words of God? Maybe you are Muslim today. Maybe you're Orthodox today. Maybe you're Pente today. Have you read the words of God? Every time prophets were sent, the people of God stoned the prophets. People don't like to hear the words of God. They struggle. Because every time the word of God is preached, it teaches us to give up our sin. No one wants to give up their sin. This is the problem. When you hear a preacher and people take their hand and say, I don't want to hear the preacher, that's the devil. Why would you not want to hear a preacher? Because your life wants to stay in sin. This is the same thing that happened to Israel. They didn't want to hear the preacher. And so God had to send prophets to continue to preach. Do you know why God sends prophets? He sends prophets because he loves you. You know what our problem is in this world? It's our sin. It's our corruption. You know what the problem is with Ethiopia? You know what the problem is with the West? You know what the problem is with, with Europe? It's sin. It is your sin that separates you from God. It is your sin that destroys relationships. This is why we preach. This is why God sends prophets. Because he loves you. God wants you to be saved.